Hey guys, and welcome to I Am Brutal Plays for Free. And this is my new uh, free to play game series. I'm just going to be bringing you gameplay footage, commentaries, general information on where to download these games, whether I think they're any good or not. And yeah, basically, that's it. So today we're going to be playing Bullet Run, which I really enjoyed actually. I played it longer than I thought. I thought I was just going to play it, you know, to do the video and then that was it. I'll move on to something else. But I gave it a few games. It was actually really good fun. So it's definitely worth downloading and seeing if you like it because it didn't take too long to download. If you just search in Steam, you can get it directly through Steam. Bullet Run. And there you go. You just start downloading that. It's totally free to play. There is, there is kind of like, it's a little bit of a pay to win game. So, you know, you can sort of buy guns and rent guns and things like that, but I don't think it makes too much difference. So anyway, I'm just going to run through a few of the, the game's key features. So this game is free to play, obviously, and it's a first person shooter, so it's like any old sort of Call of Duty game or anything like that. You know, it's your basic team death matches, Search and Destroy was one of them, I didn't try it, but I don't know if it's the same as Search and Destroy in Call of Duty. Uh, free for alls, things like that. But the game's story is a is, uh, what makes it slightly interesting. It's supposed to be set in a, as if you're in a reality TV show where everyone's got to kill each other. So a bit like sort of Death Race or The Running Man, you know, that sort of thing. And you get this cool like active reload thing, which is almost identical to the one in Goes of War, where as you reload, you get a little wheel that pops up. You'll see it in the gameplay if you if you look out for me reloading. And um, you'll see me failing at hitting it, but you know, if you tap R to reload, then you tap R again when you hit the little the little speck on the wheel and it and it turns green, you get an instant reload button. And if you leave it, it doesn't take too long, but then if you miss, if you try and miss, you know, you, you jam the cartridge and you take ages and you're, you know, risking yourself getting owned. So there's um the six arenas and they're usually sort of industrial looking areas, you know, you've got tables all over the place. I think one of the, the one I'm on is like an oil rig. And uh it's quite nice, it's a nice look. Like there's plenty of cover, plenty of windows, you know, you've got your knife as well and your grenade, like you just saw in the gameplay there. So you have to equip the grenade, you know, like one one on your keyboard is your main weapon, two is your pistol, three is a grenade, and four is knife. And obviously I guess you can change your loadout because it gives you an option of four of them. But obviously because I've just started, they're all just an MP5, a basic grenade, and blah de blah de blah But I guess you can go for whatever you want, they keep advertising guns to me. But I don't want to buy any. So anyway, this game's got a bit of a Call of Duty feel to it, you know. You can tell the sort of the running is very similar, the, you know, but you, you can't really get away from from that, you know. Call of Duty is like obviously the biggest FPS game at the minute, you know. Call of Duty and Battlefield. I'm just gonna give Battlefield a little shout out. It's fucking awesome. But anyway, it has a bit of a kill streak system. So as you can see at the bottom of the screen where it's got my the 49, there is like four different things, and one of them I think is available. I don't think I actually use it. So I think if you hit, I think it's E or F, I, I'm not sure, but a little sort of wheel comes up of options and they're like using your kill streaks. and one of them you'll get like the starting ones, you get like a little sort of health stim and then there's like a Kimbo weapon, stuff like that and then the, the, four, the third one is like a little sort of flying aerial drone that you can just fly around and you can change all these and I don't know if you have to pay for more of them or you can just unlock them but well, I guess you can do both, I guess you can unlock one but then the really good ones you probably gotta pay for, you know what these kind of games are like but that's okay, this game's pretty good considering it's totally free so I'm not gonna slag it too much I'm gonna give it a break but um, yeah and additionally similar to COD again, sorry to keep mentioning COD but there is like a nemesis system, you know, like when you keep, a guy keeps killing you and you keep killing him and you're having like a constant little battle and it's like, you know, payback and all that and uh, yeah, you get you get a lot of that in this because it being based around being a TV show, that kind of fits 
You know, it's a nice little, you just killed your nemesis, blah de blah de blah. And we, we have a nice little sort of, what the fuck am I doing, where is my melee attack <laughs> moment here, and I get owned by the motocross rider that is. Party Panzer. Anyway, as I was saying. So yeah, you get you get your little hit markers that come up and then you kill someone and it's like enemy killed, you know, thingies on a rampage, they start the others on a five kill streak. You know, everyone likes that kind of stuff. It, not, not only does it sort of keep the game a bit more interesting, it fills the screen, you know, makes makes it more visually sort of, I know what's going on at all times, but you know, it it is, just, like I just say, it's informative, you know, people want to know if there's a guy on the enemy team just go, go in, letting loose on everyone. Because then you can go and try and sort him out, you know. If you didn't know about it, then you you wouldn't necessarily know who was winning. Things like that would just, you know, go unnoticed. There you go. Nemesis. My nemesis just killed me. X crazy. Anyway, well, that'll be it for today. So, hope you hope you enjoyed the video. And I'll be bringing you some more free-to-play footage very shortly. Have a good day. Bye-bye.